Hey everybody, this is your boy number one versus number 95 and welcome back again with another video. Today we have Van Scanlon. I still can't really say his name right. Comment down below how you say his name correctly while the syllables and stuff is like probably like four syllables, not ten. You don't get that reference. Yeah, so um, here's Van. I'm just going to call him Van because he's a Van. Yeah, and he's an RV. And he's got he was from the piss and cup scene in the movie and um he's got the piss and cup two piss and cup flags and a lightning mcqueen flag a tiny one and a big the king flag i like that because it's not all about lightning mcqueen you know no offense mcqueen sorry dude yeah so van scanley he's got that basic design that any other normal rv would have he's very dusty i haven't played with him in a while I haven't touched him in a while, so he's very dusty and dirty. I gotta start dusting off my cars more because they're they're getting pretty dirty and pretty dusty. Because they've been sitting up there for about months and while being touched or played with. Yes, yeah, so he's a deluxe vehicle, and uh, there's a whole entire backstory on this guy. Now I remember reviewing him, and I remember uh, my dad calling me over and over and over again for like every five seconds when I went upstairs and I tried again on this review. And, uh, and I had a lot of problems with, uh, reviewing cars back in the day in 2018 and 19, because, uh, my phone would stop, uh, would fill up storage too easily. It was worse than this phone. Now I have an iPhone 11 now. I used to have a ZTE, uh, LG ZTE back in the day. It was like a 2018, at least a 2014, I think back in 2018 it was a very old old car and i just did not like it i mean car it's a very old phone i hate the phone everybody used to make fun of me about the phone and then when i popped out the iphone 11 back in 2019 everybody was like oh i see you got that phone you different now and i had a whole new haircut and everything i was i was just a new version of myself and and uh it, everybody just said i'm new everybody just said i'm fresh i'm new but I'm still the same. I'm still the same. Number one versus number 95 or Cars and Trains Fan 69. That was my old channel. I used to review them back then. Yeah, so my dad called me over and over and over again. I thought I was like, okay, that's it. He's not going to call me anymore. I'm going to continue this review. And now, when I, oh, when I was about to open the packaging, I ripped half the packaging off. He called my name. I was like, mother -er. I literally swore. I... I was like, God, I was like, damn it, what does he want? And then I was like, okay, guys, hey, it's me, number one versus number nine. It's me, Cars and Trains Fan 69. And uh, this packaging was ripped. I had no idea how this packaging got ripped up. I just played it off, like Sam's Trains when he plays off the, uh, <laughs> when he's opening his uh, Bachman locomotives, the Bachman, Thomas, and Emily. Uh, the Emily, and I think it was Gordon, Emily, or Spencer. I think it was Emily, mostly. And his packaging was already opened. I could tell by the seal. He had to retake that just like me. And he tried to play it off like, like me. And it did not work out. And I believe the couple people believed it because back in 2018, these cars, these cars right here, the diecast vehicles, they used to fall off out of the packaging. And the deluxe vehicles, the way they are, most of some of them, probably like one of them. Thank God they put them in the boxes. I think they did. I think they did. Yeah, it's going to be 2018 rewind all over again. If I were you, I would just suggest not putting them up on the shelf and just sitting them on the little shelf instead of hanging them up because they're just going to fall off and then they're going to have to lazily tape them back in the boxes. So, and there's nothing on the back of this car too. Sorry for rambling. Hope you enjoyed the story. He has no license plates. I just realized that. I thought he had a license plate right here, but he didn't. He doesn't. He's just a bland RV. It's kind of sad. I was ex I was expecting him when I first got him to have stickers all over him because he's an RV. He goes places. He's built to go. He's built to go places. And and for some reason, he just doesn't have anything on the back. And it's just a little mark that can't be scratched off in his window. Oh, there we go. I'm gonna wipe that off. And he's got this giant ass marking in his eye. Like, I feel bad for this dude. What did I do to you? They used to be in little bins, but now they're on the shelves. They used to be in this very little bin. If... Yeah, he was like, 
in the back, I think, or in the front. You, the di the deluxe vehicles are always in the bottom. The real, the smaller cars sit on top, but he was a very delicate car because he's these and this. And then I moved him to a shelf and I was like, oh my God, I don't know where to put this man. And then if you guys didn't see this in the background, one of my old videos, my older videos on this channel, let me move some stuff out of the way because I got a lot of stuff on this bed. I got a couple other things in here on this bed. Yeah, so he used to be in here. He used to be in something like this. This is where all the old or uh, duplicates sit and the mini racers sit in here too. And uh, that used to be in a really old shelf. And this sits on top of this now. This is a Flo's Via Cafe from Supercharged Series. I might review that someday. But while I'm done finding some parts and fixing and 3D printing some parts. And I'm buying a 3D printer, by the way. I might start 3D printing some things. And I got a surprise for you guys in the future. Yeah, so he used to sit in there. And I tried to keep him away from all um, being on top of all the other cars or else. These are already starting to bend. Yeah, so there he is. There's Van Scanlon review. I hope you guys like, comment, subscribe. Comment how you think about the story I just told you guys. It's a long ass story in this video. I hope you guys like and comment, subscribe again. Helps the YouTube algorithm and shit. Yeah, see you.